Hey everybody, Jeremy here, and today I want to show you my latest juicer. This is the Hiram H310 Easy Clean Slow Juicer, and you can get it right now at a discount. During Hiram's Black Friday sale, it's going to last for a few more days, and the cost is $339. And their other juicers are also on sale for up to $200 off, so be sure to check out the link in the description if you're interested. So this juicer is basically a smaller version of the H400, which I also have right here. The H310 caters to people who want the quality of a Hiram, but also want something that is small enough to fit under cabinets and even small enough to pack away for some travel. It has the same top feeder design as the H400, and it also doesn't come with a metal strainer. And this makes cleanup a lot easier although it will still introduce more pulp than a similar juicer that does have a strainer. The juicer is assembled with just a few parts and is pretty easy to do, but it doesn't come with an integrated and removable pulp basket, and I assume that this is to save space. You'll have to use the included standalone pulp catcher instead. Both the juicer and the pulp exit from the sides. Personally, I would have preferred if the juice came out of the front instead so that I wouldn't have to turn my head in order to see how much juice is captured before I open up the spout. Now you can toss a whole apple in there if you want, but I like to give my produce a rough chop. The knob on the front can be twisted to start the juicer, or if you need to, you can twist it the other way and hold it to reverse it in order to clear obstructions. Now because this juicer is also shorter than normal, you won't be able to fit a big mason jar under the pour spout. You'll need to either tilt your glass or use something shorter to catch the juice. And just keep in mind that the juice catch fills up much quicker than a regular sized juicer, so if you overload it and walk away, you could come back to a bit of a mess to clean up. Now let's take a moment and watch this juicer in action as it processes two apples and two oranges. Here's the juice that I got from that. It's about a cup, give or take, and I got a little bit of foam on top, no big deal, and it also has a little bit of pulp. Speaking of pulp, the pulp that came out of the back, I'm happy to say, is nice and dry. I also tried juicing some more fibrous produce like pineapple and cucumbers, and the H310 had a little more trouble with these due to its weaker motor. I think it could have done a better job of mushing everything up. It took a little longer than I was expecting, but I still got a decent juice yield out of it. But just remember, this juicer isn't necessarily meant for batch juicing. So if you're looking for a slow juicer that is smaller and something that you can take with you, and something that's capable of pushing out a cup or two of juice at a time, then perhaps the Hiram H310 is for you. And again, if you're interested, now is the best time to get it because it is on sale. So check out Hiram's website, linked in the description, and you can see everything that they have on offer. Until next time, take care of yourselves, and I'll speak to you soon.